tell her truth, which is that that relationship between them wasn't one she entered willingly. And I have the feeling that that is going to be a big theme here, as it has been in the Eugene Carroll case. And the district attorney announced today that if they get to cross-examine former President Trump, they believe the verdicts in both of the E. Jean Carroll cases are fair mm -hmm. game, including the finding that Trump sexually assaulted E. Jean Carroll. And Harry, let's get in on what the prosecutors are thinking now. They're going to have to give the name uh, of whoever that person is. And this is what Ruth Ben-Ghiat, who specializes in autocracy, she said, as a scholar of strongmen, I agree with Mary Trump, that's Trump's niece's assessment of the psychological cost of the trial for Trump. Some individuals cannot bear the feeling of being constrained by others. The usual forms of asserting dominance are not available to him in the courtroom, but they are available outside the courtroom. As soon as that name is released, we know what he's going to do. So a few things. First, their non-release of it, Joy, this, it's not a small point. You can guarantee that the two Trump lawyers are going to have a hellish weekend. It's one thing to prepare solidly to, to cross-examine someone you know who it will be, that it could be anyone at all. That's a serious sort of sanction for his um, misbehavior. But second, yes, it, you know, it, it, it is exactly uh, as you say. The, there has been, on the one hand, a, he, Judge Merchant made quick work of things, Justice Merchant, but yet there are these eruptions of kind of chaos and stress, and we have almost a tale of two trials. And as it goes forward, those will be the sort of high points that people remember. And this, this trial could be really freighted going forward, or it could stay smooth. It's been mm -hmm. uh, two different kinds of weeks, it seems to me. And if you were prosecuting this case, who would you call first? Because there are different ways to do it. I mean, Michael...